close together but it's okay it's not it's not the end of the world <laughs> if they're very close together that so I've got my tag little peg and pull the bobble up a wee bit and then I want this stag and I'm thinking in the middle there so I'm just going to thread it through its antler so this is the gold not sure if it's coming up. This is the gold thread that's on the wall. I'm clearly missing something here. Or I'm letting go of one end and not realising. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to tie it to the back thread here. make a wee bow oh. it's not working <laughs> Okay, I'm just tying this one in a knot. I can't get a bow in. <laughs> My knot doesn't even want to go in. But... That's that. That'll do. She can... My partner can take this off and use it later on that's that one done so i am going to go and get day 23 yes day 23 and this is going to be the special one okay so this is day 23 and this is using the bobble one again but the reason why this one is special is because this is actually made using my wedding dress now you will see me make this one in a later video. I this is part of my wedding dress projects. And inside there is just some of that and then I made some more of these flowers. So the tool is from my wedding dress. That is the crushed velvet fabric that I used on one of them. And then the top fabric is my wedding dress again. Uh, I added in this little bling centre, which I thought was just absolutely beautiful and I wanted to use it. So there is two of these flowers in here for her. And I'm hoping that this all goes in here. And the seam binding, I think it's seam binding, just sits on top to keep the little flowers hidden. And then I've also put this ribbon in here because I thought this, I love this ribbon. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's a gold one and then a white one with the gold Christmas trees on it. So I did buy quite a few packets of that. So that goes in there. Um, and I've put... 
So I'm going to do this a wee bit differently because I'm going to put the tissue paper on top instead. So that it's not actually wrapped around the gift. Hopefully I can get it down the side. And then... Down the side on that one. Okay, so as you can see this bag is quite fat. <laughs> I am still going to try and shove in one of these little Lindor bears make it even fatter No, that's not going to close, okay Right, where did I put clips? Okay, so I'm not sure if this one's going to hold. I'm going to hope it's going to hold. Just because this one is quite fat and I'm thinking about maybe taking the ribbon out of this one. Right, we'll see how it goes. We'll see if we can get it tied up first. If I can get it tied up, then I will leave it. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go away, going to tie all this up and I will be right back. Okay, so I ended up just taking the ribbon out and all I've done is I've attached it to the back so that she knows that it belongs to this day because I really, really wanted my chocolate inside because that was the whole plan and the chocolate wouldn't go in. Uh, when I tried to tie it up with the ribbon in, I felt as if it was going to rip the little holes. So I've taken the ribbon out and that is what I've done. So that is day 23. So I'm going to go and get day 24 and I will be right back. Okay, so this is day 24. I've used one of the bigger tags and I've got a little tassel, I think, that, and gold. And then I'm wanting to put the star on here. Put one of the stars on as well. And my last little teddy bear. So this is the main stocking, the belly slipper. Now I have done a video on how I put it together. Not this one. The one that I did put together was, it sort of went a wee bit wrong, so I explain more in the video. But this is the fixed one, and this one is another special one, because this white fabric that you can see, sorry about that, is part of my wedding dress as well. And then I've used tartan fabric on the back because I am from Scotland and obviously Scotland is a tartan nation so I've put these little dangle charms on the end here so there's a Christmas tree, there's a gingerbread man and a little ice skate and this is where the red sea beads came in because it's all trimmed with the sea beads. So let's get some gold tissue paper and get this wrapped up so that my partner can't have a sneak peek at it. It's also filled to the brim with stuff. There is all different things in here. I tried to squeeze as much as I could in but because the stocking itself is actually quite small, so it's it's long but it's narrow 
and it's very very narrow at this point it was sort of hard to find stuff that actually fitted in it but I managed eventually Now what I'm going to do is, this is the top of the stocking, I'm actually going to put this in first. And the whole reason I'm putting it in upside down is because when I had it in, the top of it was quite fat and chunky and I couldn't get this part tied. So I thought I'll go this way this time with it. And get it in. See, it's very, very tall. And this is actually... I made this bag using two bits of 12 by 12 again but I had to put the two 12 by 12s together so the seam is actually right there I don't know if the camera's picking up the seam but the seam's right there from the two 12 by 12s and it was the only way I could actually get the bag in I need a clip. My jar of clips. Some, some of the twine. Oh, I forgot the wee teddy bear. I knew I was forgetting something. Right, so because this bag's so big, he's probably just going to fall right down to the bottom, which I'm okay with because this is the last day anyway. And unfortunately that's something that can't be helped with this really big bag. So that's that done and I'm wanting my two tassels Because this is so big it's sort of a wee bit more difficult to show this on camera. So my little card.
I'm just clipping it in like that and then I just want the star hanging in the middle there so I'm just going to use the little peg again and that is it so that is the last bag all decorated now all I need to do is find a bag big enough to put all of this in so I hope you like my project share and decorating the gift bags with you um i absolutely loved decorating these and i can't wait for my swap partner to receive them so thank you so so much for watching please give this video a thumbs up sorry it is 50 minutes long um i didn't realize how long it was actually going to take to do all this stuff but thank you for sticking with me and i will see you all again soon Bye for now.